Darn, that was a, a, a tough encounter. Glad to get over it. Oh, absolutely. We're glad to, to get that one out of the way. You know, we, we knew they were going to be tough. We knew they were going to be a big physical side. But uh, we always thought that if we played well enough, we'd be able to do it. But we didn't quite play quite to the level that we really wanted to, to be honest. Maybe not the best start that you would have hoped for a wee bit wasteful up front. I played a lot around a lot. And had most of the possession, but we didn't use it in the first half. But when in half time, the manager told us, just get the heads down, work hard, and just get over the line at the end. We should be fine. They, they definitely showed spells of, of coming back at you, you know, but I suppose there's great character in the team, and, and, and he's held off. Yeah, the manager said, like, the teams are going to have purple patches in the game. It's just how well we can work with it and play against it, but just to minimise the purple patches that they had, like, which we like, say we did well enough. Uh, playing in the preliminary round of this competition, has it helped? Uh, yeah, uh, we thought, you know, getting to come up here, see the surroundings, you know, kind of get a wee bit used to the changing rooms and knowing what we're dealing with, you know, timing-wise on the bus and all that, because it's a big enough journey. Uh, so it was good to get up and experience that there and figure out, you know, in, for, the, for today, what we were going to do on the day. So it was good and I think it helped a wee bit. And you just heard the draw being made there behind you, so you now face Kalishal on the semi-final. What's your thoughts on that? Um, we would have took any team, but um, Kalishal, big side, good few players up from last week when I saw them play, so it should be a good game. Obviously, the longer you're in the competition, the more momentum you're gaining, and that'll suit well now coming in to play Kalisha. Uh, yeah, definitely. You know, boys are gaining more and more confidence coming up here, winning games, which is always, which is vital, you know, in competitions like this because the margins are very, very small. So that extra game, that wee bit more confidence, you know, it'll definitely help us going into next week in the semi-final. Back again next week, and uh, I'm sure that the boys are they're starting to enjoy this experience coming up here for the Palmer Oh, absolutely. You know. The boys maybe didn't know too much about the competition, but they definitely know about it now. You know, they see the crowds here. The crowds are getting bigger and bigger. Everybody's enjoying it, and uh, they definitely, uh, they're definitely enjoying their time playing this competition. Now that you have, you know, you're gaining momentum in the competition. Surely, uh, you know, you are looking for for a, another great performance in that semi final. Another great performance, but we're just taking it game by game at the moment, not thinking about. It final or anything, not just taking it game by game. What does it mean for Warren Point, you know, to be at this stage in this prestigious competition? Oh, it's massive, you know, the whole club is behind this team. You know, they're a very young team, they're very well supported by parents, but it's good to see more and more, you know, the senior players coming out, which the boys take a lot of, a lot of pride in. You know, it's good that senior players can come out and see the talent that's coming up through this club, and there's a lot of talent in that team. So uh, they're enjoying every bit of it as much as we are as well. So uh, this competition is massive. The prestige is unbelievable. The teams that have won it are, are brilliant, and the players that have played in it are, you know, on playing county football and all now. So uh, the boys are definitely enjoying it, and they fully understand what it means for the club and the community in one point.